Good morning, y'all. It is food. It, it, what day is it? Dang, what is that? Water already. Okay, anyways, it's Saturday, April 6th, I believe. It's all, it's just after 6 in the morning. Yeah, shit, girl, woke back up after getting into bed at 11.45. Y'all know it's just second nature at this point. But we got to go spray one property because we couldn't do it the other day because their spigot was, like, not um, applicable or accessible. That's the word. So we couldn't go fill our little spray uh, pump sprayer up. Anyways, we're gonna go do that. Then we gotta run to Sam's, and then we're gonna go to Kima. So it's kind of like a little mini vacay day. So yeah, I'll be. I'll try. I'll try my best to set y'all up and film and just make a little. Man, I'll be me talking every clip, but we'll make a little montage. Maybe. Dang, I hope that really is water. Okay, so I gotta get gas, of course, and we're gonna eat ice cream for breakfast. We're gonna eat ice cream for breakfast. Here's the fit. Yeah, so I'm taking an extra shirt just in case I get tired of this. So let's get it. We did, wow, look, my hair's freaking caught in the window. Okay, it doesn't matter, it's fine. <laughs> um, we got back from Kima and everything, bro. The traffic on the way back was treacherous. I was like, this is horrible. Like it took almost, I'd say maybe 30, 45 minutes longer than it took to get down there to get back. Um, yes, yeah, so I was pretty tired after that. I ended up taking a little bit of a nap, uh, but now we're back out. We're back rejuvenated. We're going to the city that's close by. They have like a little outdoor concert series thing during this time of the year. So we're gonna go over there, see what's popping. And then if it's like, slacking and it's just not good we'll see what we do from there but i just want to let y'all know before i put the little random clips here i was like where the f is this girl at now what is good y'all it is sunday april 7th april 7th um it is 8 15 in the morning i actually decided to sleep in can you believe it i know i never do that but I did, and it felt kind of nice to just wake up and not be rushing and not trying to be on a schedule and all that kind of stuff, but about to go out and do the, um, we're gonna get some coffee and we're just gonna go to the park, walk, chill out. We've got the cargo pants on today, y'all, you know what the f going on? So, I am gonna take a shirt though, but I'm just gonna wear the cami for now, because I'm really super hot, bro. It's 69 outside though, so, not too bad, not too bad. I'm so happy to have my freaking blinds open though. I never get to open my blinds in the morning because it's always dark. Y'all, we're breaking out the new nights, bruh. And look, this hoe has freaking purple soles. Oh, oh my God, they're too fresh. I have to put these on because I don't have my other ones. Oh my God. Oh my God. Oh my God. Oh, oh, who is she? Who is she? Hold the f on, bruh. It's got the shoe charm on this hoe and everything oh not the fresh nikes not the oh child oh lord it's 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 game on today it is game on today good morning y'all it is monday april 10th i want to say i'm not 100 percent sure because i need to look at the date before i started this clip but it's fine it's almost 6 a.m I know, almost 6 a.m. <laughs> Finally got done getting ready. We got a sod and mulch job today, so I'll try to set you up for that because we have to rip out like half of the backyard of the grass that's already there. So we have to rip all that out, clean it all out, till it, put some compost down, then lay the new sod, and then also weed it down the beds and mulch that. So we're gonna do that first so we don't have to destroy the new sod um, with the wheelbarrows. So yeah it's gonna be it's gonna be fun it's gonna look so good afterwards so that's always the thing i'm excited about but i finished my freaking book last night the one um blood dreams by kate hooper i think is what it was called right here um it's actually pretty good i don't usually read like mystery thriller books but i'm glad i picked that one up so about to start roses by uh layla beecham i guess that's how you say it but yeah this one's one of the thicker thicker books so i'm excited for this one though I'm excited because it's kind of like historical fiction, I guess you could say. So, yeah, it's Monday, ladies, and I'm actually not upset about it. So, it is supposed to rain at like two today. So, hopefully, we get that job done before then, which 
pretty sure we booked. It's only three pals a side. So we should be good. We should be good. All right, y'all. As you can see, I made it home. I'm in my freaking pajamas. We're literally about to lay down. But it's 822. And that side job that we did today, that was, that was something. So I'm going to narrate over the parts starting now. So I'll see y'all back here in a second. But we ended up getting there. We had to uh, weed eat all the weeds out of the beds, clean those out. So get the leaves and all that kind of stuff out. And then we ended up cutting down all of the grass that was in the backyard because there was old grass there already. So we had to like weed eat it down and then till it out and then put some compost in and all that kind of stuff. So we did all of that. And then we finally got to lay in the sod. After, of course, we put the brown mulch in. We did brown mulch in the beds that were there. So we ended up doing all that. Then we started laying the sod, which it was curved, the bed. So we had to kind of lay straight lines so that we could make it as straight as possible and then fill in less gaps. Then trying to follow the curve of the bed and then go from there. Um, but yeah, did all that. And everything ended up looking really, really good, I think. Anyway, but yeah, it was a successful job. We ended up liking it in the end. So we got everything done and looking right. Okay, now we're back to the regular part of the vlog. So yeah, after that, we just had to go back home and unload the trailer and all that stuff, put the mowers back on it, started pouring as we were finishing up unloading the rest of the mulch. So I got freaking soaked, dude. My clothes were soaked through and through. My hair looked like I just got out of the shower. Um, but yeah, definitely a successful day overall. Glad we beat the rain with the job and all that stuff. So yeah, now I'm about to chill out, read. I'm finally starting this book, Roses by Leah Meacham. Layla Meacham, I guess that's her name. I still don't know for sure. But yeah, I'm starting that book. Seems like it's going to be pretty good. It's like a historical fiction type of thing. So I used to read those all the time. But yeah, I'm just going to chill out. Maybe watch all in order and then we'll read because I want to have no screen time before I go to sleep. So we're going to do it in that order. Yeah, I'll see y'all tomorrow. Hopefully. <laughs> what is good, y'all? I don't know if I started the vlog today. For some reason, I feel like I haven't. But it's April 9th, 7.53 in a p.m., I'm about to eat some Neapolitan ice cream. I haven't opened this. I bought it like almost a week ago. <laughs> but I'm about to just do that. Sit down. Watch some YouTube because I really need to calm down right now. Like I feel really agitated. Don't ask. It just happens sometimes. I just get like really frustrated really quick because it feels like there's so much going on in my head at the same time. And then just like outside stuff annoys me on top of that. So it's just like a disaster. It's like when you see like bees swarm. That's me in my head. So... <laughs> Anyways, we're going to sit down, chill out, calm down, cool down. And I ended up moving some money stuff around and doing some like big girl things as they call it, adulting things. And I'm going to end up getting myself out of a situation that I put myself in that was not smart. But that's the thing I love about being in my 20s. Well, almost not. Um, but yeah, being in my 20s and learning a lot of new things and just trying to think outside of the box and learn how to play the game that we call living in America and it's just I don't know it's just it's so cool to know that your brain can evolve like that and you can kind of learn new information and utilize it and put it to use and I don't know it's so cool but I ended up working some stuff out and it's gonna put me in a better space for the future so I'm excited I am so excited but yeah I will not see y'all again because I'm just gonna shower read lay down and go to sleep I don't have to get up early in the morning but we do have to work tomorrow afternoon so I'll see y'all when I see y'all I don't follow rules and they don't like them. Hit the club with white people running time back.